Well, actually, it's been a long pre-season. How, how do you feel it's gone, all told, as a team and for yourself? Um, I think it's gone really well. Um, obviously, it does seem a long time ago since we, we first came back in and obviously got reacquainted with each other. I've seen myself being new and stuff, trying to integrate in the in the group, and it's been it's been really good. I felt at home from day one. Really, the lads have been really welcoming. Um, and pre-season has gone really well. We've put in some really good work, some really hard work, um, and I think we're we're just at the right tipping point now, ready for, ready to go into the season. And thanks to a couple of additions and a couple of faces that were already here, that, that is a, a bit of a group that you'll either played or worked with here now. Before. Yeah, yeah, definitely. And obviously, it's. Um, Football's quite a small, small world, and you uh, you do run across a lot of uh, similar faces at different clubs. So it it was it did make it a li little bit easier in that sense. But like I say, all the lads have been really welcoming, um, and I think obviously um, previous relationships of the clubs has has helped to to fall into the squad nicely. So yeah, it's uh, looking good. And pre-season seems to have followed a, a similar kind of formula, really, in, in the sense that some of the lads will want to have improved on, some they've been really pleased with. Yeah, yeah, for sure. It's um, like I said, preseason is there to uh, to improve and to, to work on your fitness and to to develop as a team. So uh, I think we've done that. We've come together as a good unit. Um, everyone knows their, their roles and responsibilities within the team, um, whether selected or not. And everyone's raring to go and uh, itching to be in that starting lineup on uh, Saturday. You came with a quite clear brief uh, and a want to score goals. You managed a few at the back end of pre-season. You're you feeling like you're, you're edging in, into the right kind of sort of match feeling now. Yeah, like? definitely, definitely. Like I say, the um, the first few weeks is just getting uh, sort of summer out of the way and getting back into it. And um, I think as pre-season has gone on, I've improved more and more over the games. And it's and like I say, it's nice to to start chipping in with the goals and getting that feeling back again. Just just in time for the season to start so uh, yeah really looking forward to it and hopefully I can continue that form on into the season and that partnership with Joe obviously hopefully will be very profitable during the season but there's a lot of competition in that striking area as well which is great for you guys yeah definitely that, and that's 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 what it takes to be a successful team you need you need a squad and you need players pushing you every day to keep improving and keep on top of your game because it's only going to help the team on the pitch so um, no there's a like you say there's a lot of competition and uh, people are ready to step in when when called upon. So it's it's about the players that do get the starting starting shirts that they uh, they stay on their toes and they put in 100% uh, every week. And looking ahead to Saturday, Alfredson, if, if you were going to pick a, a difficult start, it probably would have been top of your list, really, wouldn't it? Really? Yeah, definitely, definitely. They've uh, they've made some uh, improvements over the summer and they're. Uh, they're looking to do big things themselves, just as we are. But um, it'll be a good test. Uh, I think the Solio game was a great, a great last game of pre-season to put us into the frame of mind we need to be in going into the season. So uh, we'll be more than prepared. Um, and if we go and set our stall out and do what we're about, then I think we'll uh, we'll have a good chance. And it's one where you're going to have to be good in, in both boxes, I guess, isn't it? When you consider the likes of Denton and, and Pennicket. Yeah, definitely, definitely. And that's but that's going to be the. The story of all season really it's going to be a lot of um, who's going to be better in both boxes and if we can uh, <coughs> we can come out on top in most of them then I think we'll uh, we'll have a great chance of uh, doing great things this season.